morning everybody it's travis miller here with sexy skirt tackle and it's a great morning and it's a great morning because these products that i'm about to show you right now are on sale we finally did it we've launched sexy skirt tackle and i want to do this video to provide you the description of the baits that we're selling while we made them the way we made them while they're better than the competition and why you should be throwing sexy skirt tackle all right so let me jump right into this if you haven't already watched our flipping jig uh, video, you should. If you are a flipping jig person who likes to throw in the laydowns, throw in the matted vegetation, you should check that video out. Because I guarantee you that hands down, we are producing the best flipping jigs on the market. So I'm going to start with the flipping jigs. But I'm not going to do too much in depth with them because, like I said, I put a 20 minute video together on why these are designed the way they are. Uh, but when you get your flipping jigs, when you order them, they're gonna come in a package either like this or like this. It's gonna depend on what I get a better deal at, right? Because look, I'm not making packaging, I'm making the jigs. So it's gonna depend on what I have available, and what I can get the best price at, and save you money, really. Let's jump right into this. Like I said, it's just a recap. If you really like flipping and you really are looking for a good flipping jig, check out that video. It's a great video. All right. These are Arky style heads. Best head you can have for flipping jigs. Hands down. Hands down. That is the best head that you can get for flipping jigs. Weed guard. This weed guard, this is where it's at right here. This is a lot of uh, what I put a lot of research and a lot of time into. As simple as this thing right here is this has just enough fibers in it to be stiff enough to toss into lay downs thick lay downs and come out but it's also soft enough to allow you to go through the matted vegetation and pull it back out without pulling half the river bottom with you or lake bottom the skirt trim skirt Trimmed right where you want it. I left enough length that you can trim a little bit more if you want, but that right there is trimmed perfectly. Weed guard is also trimmed for you. Weed guard, the weed guard's right in front of that bar, which is exactly where you want it. These flipping jigs, these are the deal right here. These are the flipping deal. All right. The skirt. Some of our skirts are going to have the minimalistic approach, which is going to be real thin strands, as thin as I could cut them. Some of these jig skirts are going to have minimalistic skirts with them, and there might be a touch of a normal, a normal jig skirt that you're used to. But this is where it's at right here. It's all about the skirt, people. This jig right here, if you take a one ounce sexy skirt flipping jig and you use your normal trailer that you would use for any other jig when you're flipping, put that on with a one ounce competition jig of any kind, you're gonna get a faster fall rate with this. I guarantee it. With the minimalistic skirt, the weed guard trimmed the way it is, and that arky head, this is gonna fall faster than the competition. And that's exactly what you want with flipping jigs, so it's a reaction bite. Put a lot of thought into this jig, two years of development to get this sucker out, and it's here. It's ready. After the flipping jig, we also came out with a bladed jig. Listen, I got sick of paying $15 for these jackhammers. All right, I know they're good. I know they are. I know they catch fish. At the same time, sometimes you can take a $2, $3 bladed jig from Walmart and catch fish. You can. It's just the way it is. The components are a lot cheaper. And you can buy these. All Everybody's making these now, it seems like. And there's, what, there's thunder crickets. There's jackhammers. This is, since I'm retired Navy, we're going to go ahead and call this the torpedo. It's going to be our line. Well, why should you throw this over the competition? Well, for one, who wants to keep throwing $15 jackhammers? Are they really that much better? N not really. But what makes them better is they bend that blade a little bit, right? And I'll give it to them. I'll give it to them. They did develop that, and it works. 
It's awesome, actually. But I have that too on these. So we've taken that element and we've put that into the sexy skirt bladed jig, the sexy skirt torpedo. All right, you see that bend on that, that, that blade? It's about a 20 degree bend. This is a really aggressive bend, which is, which is good. I mean, this is supposed to vibrate, right? This is supposed to look like bait coming through the water. It would be just like your swimming jig, but if you're not gonna bend that blade, then why won't you just throw a swimming jig? You want that thump, right? We used a heavy duty snap ring. I do not like mounting a blade straight to the head. That is the difference of these. Could I pour a lead head and connect the bait and connect the blade right to the head? I absolutely could, but I don't like throwing them that way. I like the wobble. You get much more movement out of this blade with that heavy duty snap ring, all right? And then we have the swivel here, which is also, that's money right there. It's exactly where you want it. Heavy duty snap, heavy duty split ring, and you got your minimalistic skirt, and you're gonna get a full skirt. The skirts on these will be a little bit fuller, but you're not worried about drop rate with these. It's got a heavy duty hook. I should have mentioned that in the flipping jig. That's a heavy duty Gamagatsu hook. I can probably do it at the same time I'm showing you this. I want you to look at these bait keepers. That bait keeper right there, and that bait keeper right there, best in the business, hands down. You will not find a trailer that's gonna come off of that bait keeper. No need to super glue these. When your trailer comes off of that bait keeper, it's time to change the trailer because it's trashed, all right? These will swim straight right out of the package. There's no tuning with these. Everything you get from Sexy Skirt Tackle is trimmed and ready to throw. You do no need to sit on your front deck trimming skirts, trimming weed guards, bending blades, or fixing snap rings. When you open up these packages with your Sexy Skirt bait and your jig, they are ready to go, 100% ready to throw. When you're paying your money, that's what you should expect. Our next line that we're gonna be selling is buzz baits. And here's the thing about buzz baits. So we're gonna throw, we're gonna, we got two combinations. It's really all you need. You have your Tidal River Dreamers right here, right? Black with copper. Why do they like that so much in Tidal River? I really can't answer that, I just know that they do. From the James River, all the way up through New England, black and copper will just flat out work on title systems. We're also going to offer a bait color, which is gonna, which is just your basically your shad pattern. And sexy bait, the components are the same, same wire, just different color bait and different color skirts. But that's the only two we're offering. Can I do custom orders? I sure can. I sure can if you tell me what you want. But our color selection for all of our tackle, jigs, bladed jigs and buzz baits. We selected these colors and these blade combinations based off of what works. That's truly what it is. What looks like bait. If someone wants me to make some kind of bubblegum purple thing, I'll make it for you, but that'd be a one of a kind deal. I'm not gonna make a bunch of them. For you Texas boys out there, I will be coming out with some Rayburn colors in flipping jigs and in bladed jigs. Other than that, pretty simple, bait related. I got two colors in buzz baits. I got about six different colors in flipping jigs. Spinner baits, I have about four different colors, but we'll get to that here in a second. These buzz baits, what makes these better than what you can buy on a shelf? See that bend in that blade right there? So anybody that throws a buzz bait knows that the anxiety you get when you throw that sucker out there and you're just waiting on that real handle because you know you got to start cranking as soon as it hits the water to get it back up and you're cranking until your arm falls off sometimes. Well, with that bend in that wire right there, this thing's gonna hit the water and it's gonna get up on plane a lot quicker. You're still gonna have to crank fast initially, but that's any buzz bait. But this one here is gonna come up a lot quicker. Once you get it on top of the water and you're going, this is an oversized blade right here. This is gonna allow you to slow that reel retrieve down and it's gonna stay on top of the water. And that, you can, reel, you can still reel fast if you like, but sometimes you don't wanna be burning this thing. Sometimes you just wanna slow it down a little bit. Well, this bait allows you to do that. 
In addition, there's all I, I know guys have all kinds of tricks out there to make these their own and make them squeak the certain way they want. You can right take this rivet off, sandpaper it down. You hang them out your truck, <laughs> hang them out your truck window, and let the wind just blow on them for your ride to work or something. With these guys, are still going to do that. What I'll say about these is I put a bead at the top and I got a bead at the bottom, and it gives it its own unique sound. The only thing you have to do is take this out of the package and throw it. It's good. It might not be the unique sound you want, but with these two beads, it is a unique sound compared to others. If you still want to modify it, knock yourself out, but you don't need to. Skirts, still rolling with that minimalistic skirt. I don't, I don't like the full skirts. I don't think you need the full skirts. And when you throw these, you're going to understand why, because I have cut these so thin as thin as I could possibly get them in this rubber, that they just they just flow, and you'll you'll see that when you buy them. But these buzz baits, these are the deal. These actually, these are, man, these things are awesome. The next thing I want to talk about is our spinner bait line. Now the spinner bait line isn't out yet. It's coming, but it's not out yet. There's a few things I still need to do to this to make them work. But it's going to come in a package like this. I don't even have a label for it yet. It's going to come in a package like this, spinnerbait package, obviously. And we got some cool colors. All of our colors at Skeski Skirt Tackle are designed to look just like bait. If you took a picture of a perch and you put it beside that right there, it's going to be the exact same colors. All right, our bait. You took a picture of an alewife and you put it beside that. Hands down, 100%. We will have the best color skirts in relation to baits. On our flipping jigs, our flipping jigs, we have crawfish patterns and your bream patterns. It's all, and we have the black and blues. We have black and blues offered in every color. Listen, if you buy these sexy skirt tackle products, you can't go wrong. You're, you're not going to be disappointed, I promise you. We have put a lot of time into making these the way that we have made them. I've thrown them all. I've thrown them all for a season now. Some of these lures I've thrown for two seasons and they just flat out work, hands down. You can find them right now on Marketplace. I'm gonna use Marketplace as my selling platform until I get a website up and running. It'll be sometime this year. Uh, I gotta, I've gotta be honest with you, once tournament season starts, I'm going to be busy. I'm still giving me time making and produce orders. I'll still be putting stuff on social media, but it's going to be more of a fishing platform at that point. I'm going to take all these products. We're going to do short videos on the water with tackle setups, how to throw them, and hopefully we're going to catch some fish on the video. So Facebook Marketplace is the place to buy them right now. You can also reach out to me on sexyskirttackle at gmail.com. You can email me. If you have special orders, you can message me. I've already had a couple people message me about special orders, and I haven't even put this video out yet. I can do special orders. I can. You just gotta realize it's just gonna take you a little bit more time because if I don't have the particular skirt color you're looking for, then I have to go out and find the material, get it back, I have to cut it. And I have to make it if you want it's a different weight. That's more stuff I have to do. So you just have to understand that if I don't have what you exactly want in stock. I will make it for you. It's just going to take a little bit longer to get it. That's all. Listen, I'm excited, man. It's here. It is time. Let's start selling this stuff. Let's start throwing this stuff. Come this spring, I would love to see Sexy Skirt Tack on all your boats. I would even love to go to a tournament and get beat by you throwing my lures. Because it happens. It's already happened to me a couple times. Satisfaction. I love it. If I'm going to get beat, beat me with my own tackle, right? Listen, small company. I'm a tournament angler. We're starting. But we're here. We launched. We're starting. I appreciate you. I appreciate you giving me the consideration to buy this, to look at it, and just to view this video. And I thank you for that. And I wish you would subscribe, please, and like it. And we're going to have some fun this year. I got a plan. We're going to do some videos this year, and we're going to get out in the water, and we're going to throw these. 
In addition to that, I'm going to do some other short videos that aren't just sexy skirt tackle. But we're going to learn some stuff this year. And we're going to learn some stuff at the beginner level, the intermediate level, and maybe even some of the tour guys might even learn a little knack or two about why I've made some of these lures the way they are. Listen, I appreciate you. I really do. Like it. Subscribe to it. Check us out on Facebook. Check us out on Instagram. I'll be posting throughout the season and the rest of this winter as I'm getting these baits ready. And if I come out with a new color, it'll be posted to social media. And I thank you for watching. You guys have a good day. I have to go check the ribs on the smoker. Sexy skirt tackle. It's all about the skirt.